from the previous episode of Heard on the Street, we've heard about the pivotal role of satellite in expanding digital connectivity throughout Indonesia, directly from Telkom Wholesale and International Service Director, Bogi Wichaksono. Today, we're going to talk about the successful launch of Telkom's new satellite called Merah Putih Dua Satellite with Telkomsat's President Director, Lukman Hakim Abedirauf, on their launch preparation, their success in capturing market opportunity, as well as its potential in empowering all Indonesians to join the digital economy. Pak Lukman, thank you for joining us. First of all, congratulations for the successful launch of Merah Putih 2 satellite. Can you actually tell us what is the process you undertook to make this happen? As we know, the satellite has already successfully reached the orbit at 113 East. And the entire process was proceeding smoothly, including in-orbit tests. And we already going to the new phase that what we call ready for service since uh, 26 March uh, this year. And uh, the satellite in orbit operation has, has also been uh, hand over uh, to master control in here from Thales. And it means all the operation aspect of the star already in uh, Telkomsat hands. We also have a good news that we can finish all the satellite process constructions three months faster than timeline in the contract. Okay, and to guarantee the success of this launch, uh, Telkomsat expert also make sure that each step uh, is executed. And we you know the process to build the satellite, we need to follow many, many steps uh, from the uh, determining the specifications, uh, build the technical designs, and also uh, uh, find the best partner for us uh, from the partner selections and uh, the construction itself. Uh, also to find the best transportation, you know, along we build the satellites. And uh, also we need to make sure that uh, the actual launch into orbit also uh, prepare well as well as before. By having uh, the very strict uh, process to find the best vendors, the, 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 the best suppliers to support Telkomsat in this uh, uh, satellite uh, development. Uh, finally, we, we have uh, Teles Arena Space as the winner for the satellite uh, manufacture. And also we have a SpaceX as a launch vehicle. SpaceX is, in this case, is very special. They have a, a very a good track record with 100% successful launch for uh, many, many years uh, using uh, Falcon 9. So, and also apart from these two big uh, vendors, we also engage with uh, Telesat Canada to make sure the process of our uh, satellite construction will be uh, done smoothly and and uh, finally uh, they they proven their job with very good job uh, for uh, Telesat Canada and uh, the total investment that we need for a uh, the satellite is around 3.5 uh, trillion rupees it means uh, uh, such a big numbers these big numbers are showing the commitment of telecom group uh, to deliver the best services the best quality of infrastructure uh, that can uh, uh, serve customers from now till 15 years later. Yeah, so uh, this all, this all is uh, uh, for us in Telkomsat is uh, uh, very proud to, to say that this is our first uh, high throughput satellites and today is already ready for service. And of course, we are very glad to announce that uh, many customers that need our service can just uh, call our uh, customer service to, to make sure that we can deliver the service as soon as possible. How long does it take and the process? In years? Three years? Uh, yeah, actually the total process uh, could be more than two years. Okay. Yeah. All right. And, and uh, 
We also have another uh, important milestones, mm -hmm. uh, especially for uh, selection of the partners. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we already follow all the governance mm -hmm. that uh, we have in Telkomsat and also in Telkom. So we can guarantee that our uh, selection process, uh, especially for the satellite and also for the launch vehicles, already uh, has been done prudent and uh, accordance with the applicable with uh, procurement policy and also a governance at Telkom and uh, Telkomsat and Telkom Group. We're going to continue our discussion with Telkomsat's President Director, Lukman Hakim Abide Rauf, on the next Heard on the Street. <laughs>